smile, our nose is right off of our faces. There won't be nothing but big old hearts dancing in our eyes. She thinks all the jokes are corny. Convict movies make her horny. She likes to catch up on her scrambled eggs. Swears like a sailor when she shaves her legs. Takes a lick and keeps on ticking. Never gonna let her go. He's got more balls than a big brass monkey. He's a whack now. We're doing a little bloody jump. Sly as a fox. Crazy as a monkey. Hey, it ain't called. So, hello everybody. Welcome to the Red Clay Music Foundry. Thank you so, 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 so much for coming out this evening. We appreciate you being brave enough to uh, fight the panorama. Because, you know, we're in a panorama right now. There was a comedy show here a couple of weeks ago, and the guy kept calling the pandemic the panorama. And I loved it. I fell in love with it. So no more pandemic. Don't say that word to anybody you know. Call it the panorama. We're in the panorama, and we're going to be out of it soon. So, uh, but thank you so much for being brave enough to come out tonight. We appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And this is a great time to say hello to you folks watching on EOP Live on YouTube. Thank you very much for being there. You folks that are watching on that screen, you'll notice at the top there's a thing that's called PayPal Tip Jar. And we're going to appreciate you right now for your generosity because I know you're going to unload your pockets and give it to that tip jar. And thank you, thank you, thank you in advance for that. So we are doing request. So you folks go into the chat box and request your sh uh, stuff. Almost, almost, almost made an error there. It's, it's, it's Banks' fault because I've had a couple of stories with him. And uh, we were watching golf and sharing stories. And uh, you can't share stories if you're not drinking whiskey. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's his fault. It's his fault. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's not drinking right now. That's right for Lent, but uh, I was drinking for him and me, so there you go. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching online. Thank you guys for being here. Uh, Banks and Shane, good friends, dear friends. I love them. There is as, as quality entertainment as there is out there, and you guys are going to experience it right now, firsthand, in person. You need to sound like you're a thousand people, and give a nice welcome to Banks and Shane. I have a new word. It's not the pandemic. It's the endemic. We're done. Let's let's party. Ready, y'all? Just one more time, the reason why you must leave. Tell me what's for, why you're sure you don't need me. You could tell me again, but don't think you'll convince me. You said about falling in love again, you'd rather be dead. When someone breaks your heart, you cry your eyes. There's nothing so hard about the life that you led. As far as I can see, there's no reason for goodbye. You're just running scared, and that's something I won't buy. So you lose. I won't let you go. There's nothing to show but bonus. All of this talk about leaving is strictly bad news. So you Settle down and stay with the boy that loves you.
running scared And that's something I won't buy So you I won't let you go there Nothing to show but more All of this talk about leaving is strictly bad news So you settle down and stay with the boy that loves you Yeah, you settle down and stay with the boy that loves you Ah, you settle down with the boy that loves you As far as I can see There's no reason for goodbye You're just running scared And that's something I won't Looking woman had a man named Johnny and she loved him. So she bought him a car and a suit of clothes, can't you see them? Walking arm in arm down the long canal street, Frankie loved Johnny, Lord, everybody knows. Well, Frankie came home one evening just a little bit early and she said, They could stop downtown for a bottle of bud, so she sat there. And she told her troubles to the fat bartender Said, listen, fat Johnny, has my loving man been here? He said, Frankie, frankly, I'm awful sorry That you asked me that question, cause you know I'm about as honest as a man can be Now I saw Johnny walking down the main Feeling no pain, flipping and sliding With a guy named Annabelle Then Frankie Says, oh no, no, well it can't be so because I know I know a little Johnny man who wouldn't treat me wrong So she sat there, had a few more beers, shed a few more tears Said I'm the best woman that scoundrel ever had And then Frankie, she dropped into a taxi She said to the driver, said listen I don't want no stopping on your way downtown That run around. Then Frank got out South Park Street, looked in the window, and she saw saw Johnny and Annabelle swinging there. So then Frankie took deadly aim at that deadly game. Yes, yeah, she shot her man in the middle of his big affair. Quest night. I don't know whether you said that, Eddie, or not, but it is. Birthday and song. The birth, whose birthday is it, Jackie? Bruce. 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 And 
look at you all dressed. You didn't have to get dressed up just Bunny, to come see us. Bunny As a matter Gallon. of fact, we've got a dress code here, Bruce. We're going <laughs> to cut that tie <laughs> right off of you. Get the scissors. Hope it's not a good one. We right. will do the birthday song before this night's over, my friend. Hey, I forgot to mention to you guys that are in the house, there is a merch on sale outside. It's called Perfectly Imperfect. It's 25 songs that were recorded here, right here by the boys. And tonight only, uh, it's $30. And if you want to get two, it's $60. And if you'd like to get three, <laughs> only for tonight, three for the night, $90. Special, so special, special deal. deal. Now, what if they want four, Ed? If they want four, that would be $120. But so, wait, but wait. If you're watching on YouTube and you want to call in and make an order tonight, we'll charge you 30 bucks too. There you go. It's two whole CDs full of music. I'm telling you. Yes, sir. <laughs> I saw the light, I saw the light, no more darkness, no more night. Now I'm so happy, no sorrow inside. Pray the Lord, I saw the light. I was a fool to wander in sin. I was
sing a long time here at the old RCMF tonight. All right. Well, we've been known to be that. Yeah. You, uh, That's a Chuck Shane song. Charlie we'll, wrote We'll that. do that. You yeah. want to do it well, now? Well, we do it right now. Absolutely. We'll do it now. You can sing along if you want. <laughs> Chuck yeah. Shane. Thank you. <laughs> Chuck Shane wrote that song. Yeah. I wrote this song, but it wasn't about Banks and Shane. Was too. Okay, it was. But, uh, <laughs> We're not real cowboys. We just play them on TV. <laughs> Hold her, big fella. Jim's getting this. Okay, he's getting it. As I walked out through the streets of Laredo, as I walked out in Laredo one day, I spied a young cowboy all dressed in white linen, dressed in white linen, cold as the clay. I can see by your outfit that you are a cowboy. I can see by your outfit that you're a cowboy too. You can see by our outfit that we are both cowboys. Get yourself an outfit and be a cowboy too. <laughs> All right, ready to go. All right, Chuck James, counterfeit cowboy. Yes, Somebody's got to start it, but the car is supposed to start it. Been a while. No extra charge. Saw the big time record producer up in Nashville, Tennessee. Told him I was a country singer. Would he like to come and listen to me? He looked at me kind of funny. He said, I've seen your face before. Wasn't that you playing rock and roll movie back in 1964? And then he called me a counterfeit cowboy. But I used to love to rock this town. But I don't know more. I got a steel guitar. I'm playing country music now. Then I went to the country showcase. My band, it was really smoking. When the manager saw my face, he said, you got to be joking. I saw you playing that disco meeting back in 1975. But that was when country wouldn't pay the bills, and we were just staying alive. And they called me a counterfeit cowboy, but I used to burn the disco down. But I don't know more, I got a steel guitar playing country music now. Hill climb. I knew we were gonna be fine. We got a hit record all across the land. We're a bona fide country band. I saw the very same record are up in Nashville, Tennessee. He said, I heard your record, would you like to come to work for me? I looked at him, kind of funny. I said, I've seen your face before. Wasn't that you with them big old boots just kicking me out the door? Can you call me a counterfeit cowboy? Cause we used to love to rock this town. Love to rock this town. Oh, we don't know more. We gotta 
steel guitar would play your country music now. Yeah, we don't know more. We got a steel guitar. We're playing country music now. Thank you. Thank you, boys. And, all right, Eddie, what's going on down there? Well, we got a tip, a nice tip from Dale McInerney. He says he wants to hear thank you oh, for the raspberries <laughs> this morning. So I don't know. All right. It's up see. to you, but you can it's figure it out. It's been about 40 years since we uh, did this song. Well, and Captain we'll John see. says uh, play California. California, of course. <laughs> <laughs> uh, since C. Thank you for the raspberries this morning. Thank you for the orange marmalade. And last night, let me say, when you might have gone away, thank you. The dog right under the porch there. I don't think I've done that song That's in great. 40 years. You did good, old buddy. That's great. <laughs> All right, Eddie, what, 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 Dougal and Deborah, it's so nice to see y'all. Hey. Yeah. What do y'all want to hear? I've never seen Dougal take at a your, loss for words. Take your time. <laughs> Navajo Rug. 
Nav oh, have you got it. All right, that's a good we'll one. We'll be glad to do Navajo Rock. Y'all need to sing along on this. It's easy. Most of you know it. It's I, 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 Katie, shades of, no, I, 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 Katie, that's shades right. of red and blue. That's right. I, 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 I Katie. Whatever, Whatever became. Whatever became of the Navajo rug. Y'all got it. That's right. I, I feel like, I feel like Do You got Biden. it here. <laughs> 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 All right. Y'all ready? I, 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 Katie, shades of red and blue. I, 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 Katie. Whatever became of the Navajo rug. And you, Katie. <laughs> Shades of red and blue. <laughs> Alistair asked for ghost writers in memory of Pat. We All lost right. her eight days ago, but I'm sure she's still watching. Got to thank Steve Tobin, Virginia McCleskey, and Dale McCurney for their <laughs> tips. You can speak Don't want to go down too low here, but also, <laughs> Banks' nephew wants to hear there. cowboy boots and bathing suits. But ghost writers in the sky would be right up there high on the list. All right. All right, you want to put on the banjo? Yes, sir. Let me do that. All right, you gonna put on the banjo. Little Roy gonna put that banjo on now. We're gonna get this thing rolling. We're gonna get the, we're gonna get the cows all herded up and ready to go. Here you go. One time, this was years and years ago. Oh Lord, it was uh, 
1975, and we were playing in Dallas. And good Lord, we had a good time. It was, we, we were running wild. We can't tell all the stories. <laughs> well, to put things in perspective, we got home one night and uh, the maids were opening our hotel room door to clean our room. And we, it was a good thing because we'd lost our key. <laughs> so we just followed them in there. It's not the only and, thing uh, we lost. So we, it was about seven o'clock in the morning and, and we were, <laughs> we turned on the local station and, and there was a, there was a, you know, one of these Saturday morning tele, uh, country music shows. And the star of the show, it was called Cowboy Weaver and the Pals of the Saddle. And we were just transfixed. <laughs> That's the best thing I've ever seen. And they opened their show and closed their show with this song. We said, by God, we got to do this. That's a good one. That was a good one right there. Cowboy Weaver and the Pals of the Saddle. I forgot about them. <laughs> Hang on, wait, 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 wait. I was all ready to go there. You got your giddy up on there, cowboy. For Pat. Do what? For Pat. For Pat? All right. Here you go, Pat. Oh, cowboy went riding out one dark and windy day. On a ridge, he rested as he went along his way. When all at once the light, he heard red eye count he saw coming across the rugged plain. Had up a cloudy draw. Yippee I -E. Black and shiny, and their bows were made of steel. Their brands were still on fire, and their hot breath he could feel. A bolt of fear went through him as they thundered through the sky, cause he saw the riders coming hard, and he heard their mournful cry. Yippee, I hear. Sat there watching them, he heard one call his name. If you want to save your soul, my hell, riding on this rain. Then cowboy change the ways of day, with a shield will ride on horses beating fire across the endless sky. Yippee, I Yippee, I Been known as the same as Walking, but 
right just to sit right down Pull on over to the side of the road Show you what I mean You're talking in my ear. Well, I would stride around with a gypsy gal named Shannon, daughter of the devil. It is strange that I should mention that to you. I haven't thought of her in years. song for you. We're a little pissed that you're late, but because uh, <laughs> this is kind of an opener. This isn't something you just throw in in the middle of the show. We got nowhere else to go, though, so, so keep going. So we'll do it. All right, all right, hang on. That's right, Doug. How was the ball game? We lost the Hey, boys, we got some tips coming in. Okay, let's hear it. Robert Johnson wants to hear Carolina on my mind. That's a good one. And we also got a tip from uh, Cindy Hollowell, who wants to hear Be Ready to Sail. Oh, oh man, Cindy, really you're just song. the best. Is that it? That's it. <laughs> I just felt like there might be more. It, no, it's a little light this evening, truthfully. All right. Hello there, Doug. It's your old buddy's banks and shade. Don't try and slide one by you once more. No matter how you do it. You just do it like you know what you're doing. We've been down this road once or twice before. Just getting by, home getting by is our stock and trade. Living it day to day. Picking up the pieces wherever they fall. Just letting it roll, letting the high times carry the load. And we're living our 
life's easy, come easy, go. Well, you know, it seems like only yesterday we rolled into this town. Band of pickers nobody ever heard of before. Now we're all sporting beer bellies while well, I got some glasses and a bunch of gray hairs. We've been down this road a few times before. Just getting by, home getting by is our stock and trade. Living it day to day. Picking up the pieces wherever they fall. Just letting it roll, letting the high times carry the load. We're living our lives easy, come easy, go. Just getting by, home getting by is our stock and trade. Living it day to day, picking up peace wherever they fall. Just letting it roll, letting the high times carry the load. And we're living our lives easy, come easy go. Well, you know, y'all, it's been damn near 50 years now. We're still kicking and picking. But wait a minute now. Y'all have gotten old. I ain't no spring chicken either. My dad's card sure as hell been punched. Just getting by, getting by is our stock and tree. Living it day to day. Picking up a piece of wherever they fall. Just letting it roll, letting the high times carry the load. We're living our life easy, come easy, well, that's right. Just getting by, home, getting by, is our stock and trade. Living it day to day. Picking up a piece of wherever they fall. Do, 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 do. Just letting it roll, letting the high times carry the load. And we're living our lives easy, come easy, go. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. That is correct. What do you got, Eddie? I got some things. And y'all can yell. Fonz wanted to hear, please play the Pilgrim. Robert Johnson said, everything they do is great. Al Raquel says, cheers, Banks, from your old Albany pal. Y'all still do the Irish trilogy. Yeah. Ooh. Hmm. They, you know what? Once Al, a year. Al, they should do the Irish trilogy, is but they probably. Is that Al Rankle? Is that Al Rankle? Yes, it is. Yeah. All right. All right, yeah. Al. Janet Hoffman and John Raines also put some tips in the jar, and we want to thank them. And uh, Jeffrey Orvis put some tips in the jar, and uh, Lisa and Jeff from Duluth put some tips in the jar. Thank so. you. There you go. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right, you may have to remind us of a couple of these. But, uh, <laughs> this song was written by Pat Alger, who's from, I guess, La I think Pat's from LaGrange. Isn't that right? Yes, you're right. And uh, he, he wrote a bunch of big hits for Garth Brooks and a bunch of country folks. But he wrote this song, and we learned it from Claire Lynch. Who, if you ever get a chance to see Claire and her band, you really got to do it. We were very fortunate a few years ago to do a couple of shows with her. And we learned this song and it's become one of our all time favorites called Be Ready to Sail. In a moment of reflection, looking back upon my life, there were times I changed direction, letting fortune pass me by. And there were seldom second chances, and nothing so profound as a lesson learned the hard way that I'll use next time around. Be ready to sail when the good wind blows your way. Be ready to sail. 
Rest your feet upon the water Catch a big wave by the tail And when a good wind blows your way Be ready to sail That song's on the CD, by the way. Oh, oh yes, it's on the CD, CD which is uh, special tonight for how much, Eddie? It's special tonight for $30 Ooh. for one, $60 for two, $90 for three. Only tonight. Only tonight. But wait. We throw in a popio, a popio pocket fisherman and some Ginzu knives and presidential plates and the entire Slim Whitman collection. So order before midnight before you forget. That was Shalom, by the way. <laughs> Bill Raines from uh, Lubbock, Texas. Bill Raines! Bill. Wants to hear Man in the Big Hat. Peyton and Raines. And uh, right. Captain John wants to hear California. Cal I have heard that before. <laughs> All right, Man with the Big Hat. Yes, sir. What was the fellow's name who wrote that? Chris, um, he, he wrote Trashy Women, too. Yeah, you're right. Chris, um, Come on, everybody. Columbus! That's close enough. Okay. <laughs> no, not Kringle. Look it up. All right, this, this is a long story with many words. I guess, I guess you've heard this one before, eh? We first met Bill Raines in Lubbock, Texas, back in the mid, early 70s. And the Brooks are in. He had a buddy, and they were starting to play guitar and stuff. And uh, they had a little duo called Peyton and Raines. Yep. And we said, gosh, Phil, you know, good luck. You know, and so we, they came to Atlanta one time, and they were playing at the Steak and Ale right in there in Sandy Springs, right next to the Lark and the Dove used to be there. And uh, we went in to see him, and it was the most flattering thing that had maybe has ever happened to us. They were doing our show. <laughs> and they did it well. They did it probably better than us. But that not only were they doing our, 
the songs that we sang, they were telling our jokes. <laughs> even, even who is it? <laughs> and that's pretty pathetic. Yeah, right? so they ended up getting real jobs, which is probably you smart. Know, you guys are better, very smart. Better path to take in their lives. So here you go, Bill. Chris Wall. In a little bar in Texas on a sultry summer day. Cowboy come in off the road just to pass the time away. Pulled a stool up the bar, pushed his hat back on his head. I listened to the stories told, the words the cowboy said. He said, I can tell you stories about the Indians on the plain. Talk about Wells Fargo and the coming of the train. Talk about the slaughter of the buffalo that rode. Sing a song about suburbs come out looking for a home. Well, the man with the big hat is by. Drink up while the drinking is free. Drink up to the cowboys, dead or a die. Drink to my compadres and me. Drink to my compadres and me. Well, his shirt was brown and faded. His hat was white and black. Pants that once were blue were black and his pocket gone and back. He had a finger missing from the hand that rolled the smoke. And as he laughed and talked of the cowboy life, he knew it were no joke, he said. Rode on a cattle drive all the way to San Antonio. Ten days in the saddle, weary to the bone. Rode all the way to Wichita without a woman's smile. And the campfire where I cooked my beans was the only light for miles. Well, the man with the big head is buying. Drink up while the drinking is free. Drink up to the cowboys, dead or Drink to my compadres and me. Drink to my compadres and me. He rested easy at the bar with his boot on the rail as he laughed and talked of times he'd had while living on the trail. The silence was never broken as the words poured from his lips. Just as quiet as the 45 that he carried on his hip. I've seen the day so hot that your pony could not stand. And if your water bag was dry, you can't count upon the land. In winters, I've seen winters when your boots froze in the snow. Your only thought was leave, but you had no place to go. Big head is mine. Drink up while drinking is free. Drink up to the cowboys, dead or a die. Drink to my compadres and me. Drink to my compadres and me. Well, he rolled one more cigarette as he turned toward the door. I could hear his spurs a jingling as his boot heels hit the floor. Tightened up his belt a notch, pulled his hat down on his head. And as he turned to say goodbye to me, this is what the cowboy said. Now the high lines chase the highways and the fences close the range. And to see a working cowboy as a sight, it's mighty strange. 
cowboy's life was lonely and his lot was not the best. But if it had not been for men like me, you would not have no West. The man with the big hat is by Drink up while drinking is free. Drink up to the cowboys, dead or a dying. Drink to my compadres and me. Drink to my compadres and me. And so we did. You know, I made a mistake on that. It was Steve Fromholz wrote that song. Right. Yep, yeah. it wasn't Chris Wall. But yeah. Chris is all mad now. Yeah. Chris is a great writer. Yeah. All right, y'all, what do you want to hear? Let's have an in house. From the live request. crowd. I never have understood why people yell. <laughs> If I believe tomorrow. No. <laughs> that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work. All right, we need a more reasonable. Private Malone, that's a great that's one. a good one. Yeah. We don't want to ballad you all to death, but that's what you want to hear, my God. My God, that's a good one. You, you, what? Chick fil A. That's another ballad. <laughs> all right. You, well, know, who we'll likes, that you sure. know who likes Chick-fil-A is Bella and Zara. Well, we got another tip here from Trish Blassingame that wants to hear the Irish Trilogy. Another one. You want to try We've that? had two requests for that. We'll try that later. Why yeah, not? we will. You do Private Malone right now. And you do the Irish and I, and I know. <laughs> At the same time. I was just out of the service thumbing through the classifieds When it at that said old Chevy somehow caught my eye The lady didn't know the year or even if it ran But I had that thousand dollars in my hand It was way back in the corner of this old ramshackle barn With thirty years of dust and dirt on that green army tarp when I pulled the cover off, he took away my breath. For what she called a Chevy was a 66 Corvette. And I felt a little guilty as I counted out the bills. But what a thrill I got when I sat behind the wheel. I opened up the glove box and that's when I found the note. Here was 1966, and this is what he wrote. He said, my name is Private Andrew Malone. And if you're reading this, then I didn't make it home. But for every dream that shattered, another one comes true. This car was once a dream of mine, back then it was new. Take her and make her your own. You'll always be riding with Private Malone. Well, it didn't take me long at all, and I had her running good. And I love to hear those horses thunder underneath her hood. I had a shining like a diamond, and I put the rag top down. All the pretty girls would stop and stare as I drove her through town. The buttons on the radio didn't seem to work quite right. But it picked up that oldie show, especially late at night. And I'd get the feeling sometimes if I turned real quick, I'd see. A soldier riding shotgun in the seat right next to me. It was a young man named Private Andrew Malone who fought for his country and never made it home. But for every dream that 
it shattered Another one comes true This car was once a dream of his Back when it was new He told me to take her and make her my own And I was proud to be riding With Private Malone One night it was raining hard and I took the curve too fast I still don't remember much about that fiery crash Someone said they thought they saw a soldier pull me out They didn't get his name, but I know without a doubt It was a young man named Private Andrew Malone fought for his country and never made it whole. Ah, but for every dream that shattered, another one comes true. This car was once a dream of his back when it was new. And I know I wouldn't be here if he hadn't tagged along. That night I was riding with Private Malone. Oh, thank God I was riding with Private Malone. Thank you. What a good song. That was just beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, that was beautiful. Thank you. That was really nice. Thank you. Yes, sir. Nope. Mary Nettles nope. wants to hear anything by Mac McAnally. Mary Nugent wants to hear Scotch and Soda. Hmm. Well, that's just too bad. About it. <laughs> not that we won't play those songs. <laughs> just not right now. Not right now. I've seen that because. look on his face. Three months it's been since. <laughs> Waiting all day to do this. Eddie just put his earplugs in. Don't cry, Eddie. Just take another drink and lay back and enjoy the ride. Oh, yeah. That's your wallet, what, Eddie. Written by Boodlow Bryant. There you go. Oh, thank and the you. crowd goes wild. <laughs> well, it may interest you that uh, he wrote this song, but he also wrote all the hits for the Everly Brothers. Oh, he wrote Dream. Oh, that, oh, that, that dude look. Look. Oh. <laughs> and he wrote this one. And I say with not a little bit of pride that there's only one band in the world, only one band in the world who has performed this song more than Banks and Shea. Would anyone hazard a guess? The University of Tennessee Marching Band is the only band in the world. Hang on.
from Johnson City, Tennessee. And I gotta get a move on before the sun. Hear my baby call her my name, and I know that she's the only one. If I die in Raleigh, at least I will die free. So rock me, mama, like a wagon wheel. Rock me, mama, any way you feel. Hey. Like the wind and the rain, like a southbound train. Arlene Dawson and Mary Nettles both have paid a little bit of money to hear Down the Road by Mac. That's a Mac good one. And that's a, a Mac yeah, song, too. That, yeah, all right. Let's do that. That's a good one. We, we made a record of that song in 1995. And I thought, we, I thought we did a pretty good job on it. it was, you did. It was. It was. And, and then about 10 years, nothing ever happened from the record and like 10 years later K Kenny Chesney <laughs> recorded this it was number one hit yeah he's pencil neck geek <laughs> no, we really like Kenny Chesney we're just kidding we're really happy for him yeah we're delighted I mean just think if that had worked out I mean we'd probably I mean, I mean, that I would like be a shame. Here. I be a, to that would be a real shame yeah. not to be here. Yeah. Shalom, are you still up there? <laughs> when you buy the CD set for thirty dollars tonight only, Shalom gives the introduction on that set of CD. How much? Twice. Is Shalom. I wish you could do that right now. It was so cool. I don't even remember what I, what I said. Well, the first time you said, ladies and gentlemen, yeah, thank thanks you, and shame. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we said, can't you like fire it up just a little bit? And you went, ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Oh, Yay. No. <laughs> no, you didn't. No, you said the greatest man on oh. stage at this time. No, no, no. It was, ladies and gentlemen, the greatest band on the stage right now, will you welcome, please, Bounce and Shame? <laughs> That's it. That's it. Perfect. <laughs> when I was a boy, four houses down from me lived a family with an only child. She was the only girl in this whole world that could make me smile. Down the road, I made up reasons to go down the road. Somewhere inside of me, there was something she took a liking to. I asked her to marry me, she said she really wanted to. Down the road, see what life's gonna hold. Down the road Her mama wants to know Am 
I washed in the blood or just in the water. And I wants to know if I make enough to take his daughter down the road before he can let her go down the road. girl says she believes that he is the only one down the road and mama wants to know is he washed in the blood or just in the water and I want to know that he makes enough to take my daughter down the road when it comes time to go down the road Wanna help her go down the road Down the road yeah. Mac McAnally, that marvelous musician from Mississippi. Sue got scotch and soda hanging out there from Mary Nugent, and Captain John says, play California, damn it. <laughs> All of my life, it's been the same. Found a pot of gold, just a rusty chain. Dealt a wedding hand. In a losing game, oh, I'm looking for the sunshine, living on the rain. Hello, Simon, are you going my way? Maybe Tucson, maybe sunny L.A. I've had some hard times, what can I say?
also on the CD. Yeah, it sure is. Available tonight, one for 30, <laughs> two for 60, three for 90, and online a special, That's right. one for 30, one. two for 60, <laughs> three for 90. <laughs> All right. We're going to not available in stores anywhere. And that has always been the case <laughs> with all of our recordings. Um, we're going to try the Irish medley. I don't think I don't think we did it for the for the Irish party, did we? I think we did. We kind of did we spoke do it? through it a little bit. Don't you whistle here? Beale family. Bell. The Bell. B E A L L. Yeah. Chris and Christopher and, and Debbie. Yeah. You was on. Come on. Everybody, come on. yourself now. Go. What is this too tough for you people? The minstrel boy to the war is gone and the his ranks of death you will find him. Aye. His father's sword he has girded on and his wild heart slung behind him. Land of song set the warrior bar, though all the world betrayed thee once for at least I right shall guard one faithful heart shall praise thee. The minstrel fell, but the foe chain could not bring that proud soul under the harp he loved never sang again for he tore its cords asunder and said no chain shall sully thee thy soul of pure and bravery thy songs were made for the pure Tell me, Shah the Pharaoh, tell me why you hurry so. Hush me, Google, hush and listen, for it's almost time to go. Either orders from the captain, get you ready quick and soon. For the pikes must be together by the rising of the moon. By the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon. For the pikes must be together by the rising of the moon. Ah, oh, then tell me, Shana Farrell, where the gathering is to be. In the old spot, by the river, right well known to you and me. One thing more, when all is ready, whistle up that marching tune. For the pikes must be together by the rising of the moon. By the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon, for the pikes must be together by the rising of the moon. Out from many a mud wall cabin, eyes were watching through the night. Many a manly heart was throbbing as the moon came into sight. 
Murmurs pass along the valley like the banshee's lonely crew. And a thousand plays were crashing by the rise of the moon. By the rise of the moon. By the rise of the moon. And a thousand plays were flashing by the rise of the moon. There beside that singing river, a dark mass of men was seen. And high above their shining weapons flew their own immortal green. Death to every foe and traitor, for which strike the march in two. And hurrah me, boys, for freedom, tis the rising of the moon. Tis the rising of the moon, tis the rising of the moon. And hurrah me, boys, for freedom, tis the rising of the moon. Tis the rising of the moon, tis the rising of the moon. And around me, boys, for freedom, tis the rising of the moon. Gypsy came over the hill, down through the valley so shady. He whistled and he sang till the green wood rang, and he won the heart of a lady. Come on, y'all. Adi-do, adi-do, da-day. Adi-do, adi-day. He whistled and he sang till the green wood rang. And he won the heart of a lady. She left her father's castle gate, left her fine young lover. They whistled and they sang till the green wood rang as they rode off together. Last night she slept in a goose feather bed with sheets of silk for her cover. Tonight she sleeps on the cold, cold ground beside her gypsy love. Come on. Sure, ring, 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 ring,
My brother took his lead, he did not tell the army. Our horses, they were speeding, it was all over but the shelter. Now we went for Palahun, hill here in mountain, we're sharing a new dog. Back fall the daddy-o, back fall the daddy-o, there's whiskey in the jar, we're sharing a new dog. Back fall the daddy-o, back fall the daddy-o, there's whiskey in the jar. was driving downtown one day, could not find a parking place, had an appointment, couldn't find an apartment, couldn't find a parking place anyway. He said, Lord, if you'll just help me find a parking place right now, I swear I'll give up the drinking, I'll, I'll give up the women, I'll go to church every Sunday. If you'll just help me find a parking place. Just then right ahead of him, a car pulled out and he said, oh, never mind, I found one. <laughs> We've been here a week or so Now it's finally time to go Can't believe how quickly time's flown Packing up the bathing suits Getting out the cowboy boots That's a sign Stopped for a little while. We were part of a tiny eye. Made a lot of friends we'll keep for life. When we get back home in Texas and they asked us what we missed, shrugged my shoulders and I smiled. Early mornings on the long boat dock, drinking coffee as the sun comes up. Lazy days, napping in the big deck chair. Walking home underneath the stars, hearing music from local bars. Man, it's like a dream. Now we ate conk and lobster. Jeff said it was his favorite dinner, maybe even the best one of his life. Dining underneath the stars, Chilean wine and Cuban cigars. quiet he said you know I worked hard all my life made a lot of dough hell I've been nearly everywhere but I don't think it gets much better than down here you know the warmth and kindness of the people no hate no crime no fear I don't think I'm ready for the world waiting for me back there need me just one more morning on the long boat dock beginning of the sun comes up lazy days napping in the big deck chair walking home underneath the stars hearing sounds from the empty bars man it's like some dream we live up the bathing suits, 
Getting down the cowboy boots That's a sign we must be going on Thank you, thank you, thank you. You know how many times we've done that one? None. <laughs> All right. It's called Cowboy Boots and Bathing Suits. Jerry Jeff Walker. You yeah. know, it's, it's, been, it's been a difficult year for everybody, but damn, we, we lost Jerry Jeff back in November, and we lost Phil Necro in December, and DeWitt, and you're, you're my only living hero. Hey, we got a $100 pledge to hear Prisoner, and Captain John says, play California, damn it. <laughs> Prisoner, Captain, Paul. Captain John, I read, read an article about the ship, the Golden Ray or whatever it was, went down in the in the channel out there in St. Simons, and the and the title of the uh, article was "Ship Happens." <laughs> All right, Paul wrote this. Then we're gonna have to kind of start wrapping things up. We gotta, yeah, we gotta pick it up a little. Yeah, well. All right, this, this is a great song, Prisoner. It's the first song you ever wrote. Here we go. Thursday morning Feeling hard to get back home Seven years is long enough To ease my mind My hat went flying higher Than my thoughts as I stepped down And I searched the anxious faces For the love Searching found the tear stained smiling face I knew so well. I thought of all the years she'd spent waiting for me. But her first words told of times that shaded and things I did not know. And I got to feeling deep inside that soon. And I don't really want to go home But I wouldn't like to stay away So I'll spend my nights in the middle of nowhere Waiting for a somewhere day And when it comes I'll just leave the past behind I'll put everything I own in a brown Yeah. 
feature Chuck Shane in doing this. We've done a lot of ballads tonight, but one more ballad. I mean, this is really sweet. And there's a great backstory to this, Chuck, if you would. Thank you, Banks. Yeah, this is a, this is a song that Banks and Shane used to sing to me when I was a baby. <laughs> and yeah. No, it's, it's a song I sang to our little daughters when they were tiny. It was a bedtime thing, and it was, uh, it's called I Like to Dream, and uh, it goes like this. If you could give me a note, uh, it goes something like this. I hope you like it. Let's 